The year that was, this week on Boss Battle. Find yourself in the Beachview area of Pittsburgh? Check out the official pizza of this show, Slice on Broadway, sharing an abnormal obsession with pizza we can relate to. Check them out at sliceonbroadway.com and tell them this show sent you. Welcome everybody to Boss Battle number 173, a show in which writers of insertcoinbegin.com to get get together to talk about video games. I'm your host, Bobby F. J. Tom, but before we get to the entertainment and good time making of this podcast, let's see what everybody achieved this week. Chachi, how about you? What did you achieve this week? Call of Duty. Call of Duty? All right. Still, we, we've, still. Been, we've been away for how long, Chachi? Yeah. Still, still only Since Call of Duty. Since the last two weeks. Yeah. Still just Call of Duty. <laughs> Nothing I've else. Almost, <laughs> I have almost uh, gotten the diamond camo for the sniper rifles. Nice. So, nice. Yeah. I am, I, am, I am one camo away from it. <laughs> <laughs> one shade of camo. <laughs> yeah, so we shall see. All right, Riz, what did you achieve this week? Fallout. All four still. Uh, yeah, and actually, um, I got, I got just cause while we were away. Just cause. Nice. I was thinking about sniping. Um, that. but I did something that you usually do, Bobby. Hmm. I made sure that this was still in the package. So you started until you until finished the game. Until I finished the game. Well, guess what? And guess I what? I never do that. Wait, Bobby. Bobby, guess what? Hmm. Would you do a finish follow up? I finished Fallout. So you're opening four. it for our audio listeners live yes. on the air? Yes. I bet that sounded really good, too. That was really quick opening, too. I can never open games that fast. I'm that good, Bo- I'm that good Bobby. <laughs> Bobby, what did you achieve in the last um, few weeks? In the last two weeks, I got Star Wars Battlefront. Mm-hmm. I've been playing that. Uh, I played a little bit of Fallout 4. I finally reached level 40 in Destiny in the ongoing me reaching level 40 in Destiny saga. I have stopped playing that game um, two months ago. I, I still enjoy it. I love it. I don't care. Um, I, 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 I was raced in one of the Sparrow Racing League games, and I actually finished third, which I was proud of myself. Wait, didn't you have to pay money for that? No. Is that no, it's like free. A microtransaction or something. No, it's free. Huh. You just go. There's a thing, a little icon on the bottom. You go to it and you just race. Um, and I got a new helmet out of it, and now I can finally wear it because I'm level forty. <laughs> so, I got okay, cool okay. things now. I, I thought you meant you actually got a real helmet. No, no, in the in the, in the game, like my my character has a feathered helmet. Ooh. No. Yeah, it's it's kinda cool. It's kinda badass looking. Um and I I downloaded The Witcher, I still haven't played it yet. <laughs> it's basically still in the wrapper even though it's a digital game. <laughs> um and I was they're having a sale on Xbox right now. I'm I'm really tempted to snag uh Transformers Devastation for twenty five bucks. So I may do that over the holiday. Hmm. But that's what I achieved this week. Um so, do you guys want to talk about like what were some of your favorite games of the year, and just uh, basically the year in gaming? Um, I, I want to talk about like what did you guys think was the biggest news story of the year? Uh, Konami. Yeah. Just this that whole fun Konami Kojima uh, cluster that was 2015 mm-hmm. with the release. With the release of uh, Metal Gear Solid Five, with them taking out the name, with them, f- with Kojima leaving or getting fired or going on vacation or having a party, whatever, and then all <laughs> this with the, the the awards show, it was like Konami was in in the news at least once a month. Yeah, I think there was a running thing where we talked about it every week. Yeah, for like at least three, four weeks now. It was like that and something with Destiny coming out. Yeah. Which, um, is, not, which is the Sparrow Racing League, which is not charged. You don't have to pay a dime okay. for. Um, but yeah, that, that was my big big story for the year, yeah. I think. Chachi, you have one? Um, probably the delay of the Zelda game. 
Oh yeah. Yet yeah. again. <laughs> so you know. I think I think that was 2014's too. <laughs> Yeah. That's a running gag this year. Right. The last two years on this show. Yeah. Oh, um, crap, guys. It's December. Are we going to delay the game again? Yep. Yeah. Delay yeah. the game, and then we're going to do that again in July. Cause... And then you know that big picture of of us playing the video game? We're going to do it again, but only in a slightly bigger screen, so it looks like we got more done with the game. Yeah. Um, my big story of the year. I'm gonna go with. Uh, I'm gonna. I'm gonna go the opposite of, of what Chachi said, um, and a positive thing for Nintendo. I think they gained a lot of uh, traction back this year. Um, with 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 the passing of Iwata, I think uh, they've done just a tremendous job lately, um, getting their content out there front and center, like with the Smash Brothers. Uh, those uh the digital Nintendo things. Amiibos. What they three was kind of cool, yeah. Um, Amiibos were huge. Splatoon mm -hmm. coming out, it was just, you know, it, it was huge as far as like Nintendo PR wise, and and now that they have the new console coming out soon, well not soon, but um, they announced the NX for the next couple years. Mm -hmm. So um, I, I kudos to Nintendo. I think I think it was a good year for them. Oh, I mean, can I change mine? Sure. Yeah, sure. Oh go ahead. man. What about Pokemon Go? Oh yeah, Ooh, yeah. Pokemon huge. Go. That Pokemon was huge news. Man, Pokemon Go is going to be said, huge next year. They said they said that uh, Pokemon are already living in in your area now. <gasps> so like they they we actually have, have the Pokemon out there. They're they're programming many, the game now, I guess. How many fights in 2016 <laughs> will be caused by Pokemon Go? The, All of them. The sad yes. thing is, they said that like only certain Pokemon can be found in, in regions, but you can trade them. So, like only you're not going to be able to catch all the Pokemon in one well, location. It's like the um. Oh, I'm catching the, all the Pokemon. Yeah. <laughs> Good it's, luck. In, it's in the song. We have to catch them all. You gotta catch them all, Pokemon. You can trade. You can trade with someone unless you want to travel around the globe. Some, uh, we're going to start a GoFundMe page. Yep. <laughs> Indiegogo. Indiegogo. Chachi to travel around and catch yep. all the Pokemon. Indiegogo to catch all the Pokemon. <laughs> Gotta catch all the Pokemon. But uh, another thing we have to mention for, for Nintendo, uh, the Super Smash Brothers... Uh, Pokemon! The, yes. The, the Super Smash Brothers ballot. That was yeah, yeah. kind of weird. Yeah, that they said, oh, any character is up for it, and then, oh, wait, our own Bayonetta won. Oh, no, 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 no. We did get Cloud. We get it. We yeah. Get, yeah. get Cloud Strife in that one. Ryu. Uh, and Ryu. But um, I thought Goku was, like, in the lead for that. <laughs> we just couldn't get the race to Goku. It probably was. <laughs> uh, I believe, well, well, that's another thing. Uh, Corey, what was it? Corey in the house was one of the top contenders. Who the heck is Corey in the house? Uh, a a uh, Disney character. A Disney uh, TV show. Is uh, it Cor Coral from The Walking Dead staying in the house? Coral, stay in the house! Um, but with with that and Splatoon, uh, Chad, you can attest to that, mm -hmm. Nintendo was huge. Yeah, Nintendo had a giant year. Yeah, and Mario and Maker? Amazon Maker. rated Mario Maker mm -hmm. as Game of the Year. Wow. <laughs> and you guys I both have it. Yeah, I don't blame them. It was a great game. It's it probably, was a really great game. It, it is one of the top three games that I played this year. Hmm. Well, let's Same get, here. Let's get, to, let's get to our choices for Game of the Year here. What, what do you guys think? Uh, or do you want to go to like smaller categories first and then let's save go that small. one? Let's go small first. Cause, okay. All right, cause what... What is your um, publisher of the year? What What do you think the best publisher this year was? Publisher? Ubisoft. Okay. Chris? Yeah, um, yeah I, 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 gotta, I gotta go. No, you know what? No. Bethesda. That's that's who I was thinking, Bethesda. Bethesda. I was thinking I mean, Bethesda. Well, they that's made... because we have, we have much different... Games for games of the year, but they mm -hmm. made so much money on on Fallout. True. So much money on the first week alone. 
It was like Star Wars of video games. <laughs> but yeah, the, to have the guy come out twice during E3 and just showing everybody his Sorry. balls. Just go, <laughs> there you go, guys. Enjoy. Enjoy your Pip Boy edition. I'm gonna right. just put put my put my phone in the Pip Boy and wear it everywhere I go, looking like a giant tool, just like that. And if and if you got the the Pip Boy edition of uh, Fallout 4, kudos to you because it was not available after a while. <laughs> it was like the few first few minutes. Yeah. Well, they uh, they re-released it. So yeah, yeah. I after everybody already had the game. And then, right. Yeah. You had uh, a second opportunity to get it. Yeah, I wasn't paying. And I wasn't gonna pay like yeah again. Right, hundred thousand dollars. All right. Uh, what what is your guys' choice for um, mobile game of the year? For phone. Chachi, I'm, I'm gonna let you have this one for, for the mobile minute here for your uh, mobile well, uh, games. Uh, Cat collector. Oh yeah. Oh um, yeah. That's a good choice. Only only the Japanese version. Yeah. yeah. The, the American version. I didn't even know not... the English version. Yeah, I, I didn't get it either. I I, I absolutely refuse to get it. Because you um, have to get whole new cats. Right. Exactly. So um, what's the fun in that? And you don't... It, the fu Half the fun of the game was, like, guessing what the hell things were. Right. It, that's, <laughs> like, that, that's exactly what I said when people started playing it in English. Um, like, half like, the fun was trying to figure out what was going on in the game. Yep. And then once the, you figured people, it out, you felt like a rock star. Yeah, right. The people who bought the game in Japanese were and are the hipsters of that movement. Yeah, it is. I am. I, I can fully accept it, though. Um, I have to say that the uh, there's uh, two runners up to this. Okay. Um, I would have to go with Crossy Road, mm -hmm. um, yeah. which was huge. Well, that was, and, that was 2014, wasn't it? I'm no. Not really sure. it was, was this year? Okay. Because yeah. I remember that took up a lot of, like... Just Chachi, and I think going week I to week. Think, I got all the characters. I <laughs> think I know where you're going with the this update. one, Chachi. And the other one by the by the same developer, yeah. um, Pac-Man 256. Hmm. Um, probably one of the best games for a mobile device this year. So, you're gonna disagree with my choice, Chachi. You're fired. Uh, <laughs> I'm, going, I'm going with uh, Fallout Shelter. I I, 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 could, I could not put it down though. I I play that game every day. It was almost as bad as uh, Avengers Alliance with me as far as like addictability. Or, like, I did not like that game. Eh, I liked it. I thought I it was did, good. Yeah. I did not like it. I have to agree with Riz. I didn't like it either. And I, I like Fallout. I don't <laughs> just didn't that like was, the game. That was you guys' choice. I, I liked it. Right. So that's why we have this show. <laughs> All right. Uh, how about um, best third-party game of the year? Oh, uh, you were right, Bobby. Crossy Road came out last year. Okay. Well, oh. it was still we played it this year. Though, yeah. So November, November of last year. So barely. Oh okay. man. Third best party. Third-party game of the year. This one's tough because. I wanna I, I I wanna hear what you guys what you guys say first before I answer this one. Go ahead, Bobby. Uh, you're gonna be surprised by this. Um, can we count a game that came out last year and redeemed itself if, this if we, year? You're gonna say Destiny? Are you yes. really gonna say Destiny? I'm gonna say Destiny. I'm gonna say Destiny because that's the most time that I sunk into a game this year. And well, I'm gonna say I'm not gonna say Destiny. I'm gonna say the Taken King. The Taken King Taken was King. pretty much Destiny because Two. It 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 delivered a unique experience as far as like I don't play multiplayer games, but I found myself playing this game more than anything. Um, and that that says a lot because I don't like talking to people on multiplayer games and stuff like that. I wrote that that article about my uh my stage fright as far as like mobile games go because of the new Star Wars. But mm -hmm. Josh, I'm going with I'm going with take the Taken King. Um, I'm gonna go with Call of Duty. Okay. Uh, Black okay. Ops Three, Black Ops Three is probably the best uh, entry in the in the series in a few years. So that's good. 
Um, <laughs> I mean, quite frankly, it is the best in the series since uh, Black Ops Two. It is. It is wow. very. It is a very, very good game. It is. Um, I I liked Advanced Warfare a little bit. I spent a lot of time playing it, but not nearly as much time as I did Black Ops Two. <laughs> so. Okay. Okay. For me, I one of the games I played on a whim, on a huge whim due to the fact that it was free on, on PlayStation when it first came out. Rocket League was so good. Oh, yeah. Rocket League. And we get to play that uh, as Xbox One owners next year. Yes. You're going to have... Pretty soon, actually. If, if you need anything from me for 2016, <laughs> you, you guys need to get Rocket League. <laughs> it is very, very, very addicting to customize everything, and it's going to be fun to play. Trust me. That's all I have for that one. Trust me <laughs> on that one. Alright, how about best original game of the year? Original IP. New hmm. game. Brand new, brand spanking new game. Hmm. I didn't play any new IPs this year. Um... Yeah, I can honestly say I played zero new IPs this year. I mean, Everything I played this year that was new was a, a, a another entry in a series. So. Okay. Mine is actually another indie game uh, that you guys should... I, I believe it's probably on sale right now on Steam. Guys, put your, put your wallets away right now. Um... But Undertale, it, it's not. It's one of the games that's not really well known. That no, it's not going to be on. I doubt it's going to be on PlayStation or or Xbox or maybe it's going to be on the Wii U. I'm not sure. Um, but it is very, very deep in what happens in that game. Uh, there's multiple levels of how you can complete the game. There's there's mis mixed endings. There's there's not endings like the ones where you have to go. Be like it actually shuts down the game sometimes when you beat the game, and you have to start it all over again, and it's a whole different game. Hmm. But Undertale is a very unique style of game, and like me talking about it right now is not doing it justice. It I lied. Uh oh. I did play a new IP this year. Yes, you did. What did you play? Splatoon. Yes. Oh yeah. I completely forgot that that's new. <laughs> yeah, Splatoon. I played. I played Splatoon. That's, Splatoon that's was the, a very close second. Yeah, that was the only IP new IP I played this year. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and, and, and I. It was, oh, good. It was so good that I I didn't realize it was a new IP. I just said slid it off as a new entry. <laughs> And my choice for original IP of the year, I'm going to go with Smite. Um, it's uh, the MOBA game. Uh, it's on Xbox One. It's on PC. Um, it's basically a MOBA with uh, using gods, like ancient Greek gods, uh, any any Egyptian gods. It's, it's really cool. Um, you can download any character you want. Uh, they have Thor. You, you can have, theoretically, you can have Thor versus, like, Ra, the sun god. Um, there's a small, like, tiny squirrel god that you can use. Um, it's just really neat, and, and I, I'm not... I haven't played a lot of MOBAs, but this is the first one I kind of, like, jumped into head first, and I, I enjoyed my time with it. So that's going to be my original game of the year. Okay, okay now we get to the console awards. <laughs> All right, uh, since you guys have a Nintendo, what is your Nintendo game of the year? Splatoon. Hmm. Uh, no, 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 wait, 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 time out, time uh, out, time out, time out, time out. <laughs> I'm going to take that back. I'm going to take that back. I, I keep on forgetting I have a new camera right here, so that's why I keep looking at this camera when this camera's on. Um, but for me, uh, Mario Maker. Okay. Mario Maker, just to, just to piss off Chachi a lot. <laughs> 
the game never pissed me off. I, well, I when, I, get, when I... I would get upset a little bit, but yeah. it didn't last. Because um, my levels are awesome, right, Chachi? Yeah, yeah, the difficult levels are what made that game great. Um, yes. But yeah, yeah, Mario Maker is probably the best Nintendo game of this year. Mm-hmm. How about that Zelda game, guys? Great. No. Uh, I'm going to go a little different because I don't have an, a Wii U. Um, I have a 3DS, and I actually got to play Smash Brothers this year because I, I purchased it. <laughs> um, right, actually, I, it, it was a fun game. I, I had a lot of fun with it on a 3DS. Um, I'm actually going to be downloading uh, Cloud Strife uh, when okay. I get a chance here um, and try him out. So that is my Nintendo Game of the Year. Yay! All right, how about Riz Sony Game of the Year? Which, what is your choice for Sony <laughs> Game of the Year? Oh man! I, like, like seriously, I going into this year, I thought I had this locked up. Like the middle of the year, I'm like, you know what? This game's gonna win it. But then I saw Fallout and Metal Gear and uh, Witcher and all those guys come out, and I'm like, I don't know what if I want to do this or not, but. This is just exclusive to Sony now. Uh, yes, I know. I know. Bloodborne. I knew you were going to say that. Yes. <laughs> I, there's no other game. There's no other game out there. Either PlayStation's exclusive, Xbox exclusive, Wii U exclusive. There's no game out there that makes me want to hate it and play it as much as Bloodborne does. And I have not beaten it yet. <laughs> I just want to throw that out there. Okay. Um, I would probably go with the same thing, only just because I, don't, I haven't played any of the other. You have PlayStation Four. Uh, have PlayStation but, but Three. Four. Oh, you have a PlayStation Three. Yeah, I have a PlayStation Three. Actually, you've played a PlayStation game. But it's yeah, not Call exclusive. Of Duty. I played Call of Duty. It's not exclusive. So. It's not exclusive. So, guys, guys, I'm gonna let you guys fight over it. For Microsoft. For Microsoft. I didn't play an exclusive. In, uh, I didn't play an exclusive uh, Microsoft, Microsoft game. So that's the thing. I don't like the only one I know is the rare exclusive, like the rare rareware stuff. Yeah, rare replay. That's the only thing I can think. Of. I I haven't played that. Um, I'm gonna go with Forza Six. Um, Sunset Overdrive was... Oh, well, that was last year. That was, oh, that was last, last year. year. Yeah. Never mind. Yes. Okay. Uh, Forza 6 I'm going to go with as my... Racing game. Nice. Yeah. I, I, I enjoyed that, the time I spent with it. Um, right, racing. Uh, it, it's cool. It's the fun. graphics the graphics are phenomenal. I mean, it. it it's like you're like... actually driving a car in, like... And now that they added rain... It, it sets up a whole new dan- dynamic of like game. Like how that's a thing now. Yeah, rain in we, games. We we come so far in, in 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 gaming that we go now they have rain in it, guys. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you right, hear guys. that? They have thunder now. What about your console of the year? This is gonna be tough for some of us. <laughs> you know what? Um, we you. Yeah, I. Hmm. I gotta agree, um, because I've only had an Xbox One for two months. Um, I played Assassin's Creed Syndicate and Call of Duty. Um, for that's, me, what, that's what I played on the Xbox One. Um, yeah. Not exclusive. So, yeah, I have to go with the Wii, the Wii U had a better year. Yeah, like, like, for me, I've been doing Smash for the last couple months with the amiibos and I've 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 done a lot of maps with Mario Maker I've even raced in Mario Kart 8 a lot thank you Chachi uh, okay. and Splatoon that was the game that actually made me want to try a Wii U or well, one of the reasons why like Mario Kart 8 was pretty big as well um, but I think they have they made strides to make Nintendo 
close to being at that level that Sony and Microsoft are. They're not there yet. Soon. <laughs> Soon. And I'm going to go with the company that I thought had the best year. And I think that was Microsoft. Say it. No, what? not Microsoft. Sony. Say it. Yeah, that's Sony. Better. Sony. I think Sony had the best year. Say it again. Um, I, Sony had the best year. I, I'll agree with you. I think they well, they've gotten a lot of exclusives that you know mm-hmm. that sound awesome. Uh, they got all the DLC first for like every game. Um, they're just having a they're they're just having a good year. Um, mm-hmm. I'm hoping Microsoft catches up next year. They're selling more consoles than anybody else right now. Uh, they sold more Black Friday. They sold more, you know, so far this year. Right now, they're they're winning this battle in this con- this drawn out console again, war. Again, I, w- I want to stress this enough. I can't stress this enough. There is no battle. What well, I mean, yeah, every every like, like, like I, know, I know I know it's it's dollar sign dollar sign dollar sign, mm-hmm. but you can get you can get Destiny on either console. Yeah. Or 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 PC. But, but my or, but get, uh, Sony had, has all the time exclusives and. Oh well. You know. Yeah. I have I have yeah. to wait I have to wait thirty days. Well, to it, get was my, like, it was like it was it was like that last year. Yeah. It, it's always been Microsoft. You had to wait. Oh, Microsoft, wait, you got I it right have, away. I have to wait. Well, well, you know what you have what what Microsoft has that Sony doesn't. Backwards compatibility. <laughs> oh, oh, they both kind of have that. I, I can play my old games <laughs> off of the shelf. Hey, hey, I played Zuma the other day. I fun. It's Xbox One. Wow. What was, what was that one again? I played so, Zuma. So far, so Zumba? Zuma. The PopCap game with the little fat little frog that spits marbles out? <laughs> nope. It's like he's a puzzle a, game. He's a chubby little frog. He's a chubby little frog. <laughs> and I played Super Meat Boy, which is like one of the hardest games ever. It is. It is very I, But it's so fun. It's so it's like it's like indie Dark Souls. <laughs> basically. Alright. Well it's time. For the game of the year. What do you got? What do you, what is your pick? Game of the year. Who wants to go first? Oh. Shachi, you want to go first? Um, Shachi's contemplating here. Yeah. Assassin's Creed Syndicate. Oh, That's interesting. Um, easily game of the year. Well, here's easily? the thing. Easily game of the year. Okay. Why? You, you disagree? I... I, I... I don't. I think we have different answers. We have we do different have, viewpoints here. We do have different answers. We have different uh, viewpoints you, because we have different likes in gaming. Right. Here, here's <laughs> the thing, though. Um, you could easily say any game that came out this year is game of the year. Correct. You could easily say that Mario Maker is game of the year. You could easily say that Just Cause is game of the year. Fallout's game of the year. All great games. Correct. Here's the thing, though. Uh, Mario Maker. How long did we play that, Riz? Like a month? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Pretty much. Just well, I mean, when's the last time you picked that up? Uh, a couple months ago. Right. It's going on two months now. I'm still playing mm-hmm. Assassin's Creed. Hmm. Okay. Um, it, it's just... Uh, it has improved so much. The graphics, the story, um, the overall gameplay... They actually uh, finished the game this time. I finished the game last time. No, I mean they uh, they actually finished the oh, game yeah, this yeah, time. They, they finished the game this time. Um, it was a full on, uh, new edition of the story. Hmm. So I mean, it was the best. Mm. Cool. All right, Riz, what's your game of the year? And I get to face Jack the Ripper soon. So oh, nice. You know, oh, is that DLC? Yeah. Nice. Go ahead, Riz. Sorry. That's okay. Is it Finn Balor, Jack the Ripper? That's no. a different show. That's a different show, Bobby. <laughs> we don't do that show here now. I know. Until, until next year. Um, to me, it comes down to two... It comes down to two. Two games. Uh, I can flip I can flip a coin each, each time, uh, but I... 
Like, I don't want to just wimp out and go fall out. But it was a really awesome game to play. But it had to be Bloodborne. Okay. It had to be Bloodborne. It has not beaten Bloodborne. <laughs> I, 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 I stick by my... I believe we did this six months ago in our, in our half a year awards thing that we did. Mm-hmm. I want to say we did that. It could I be think wrong. something like that. Uh, but I still got to stick with Bloodborne. Like, like, like I was saying, bef- saying before in the IP one, to have that level of difficulty not be frustrating and want you to succeed in playing that game and being that giant boss and doing all these other things, it's, it's, a, it's rewarding when it happens. And it, 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 trust me, I have sat in this very chair and just stared at a screen for the, for the, for a few hours after be, beating a boss because <laughs> I have no idea how I beat the boss. Um, but yeah, like I said, I can I can flip a coin between Fallout and and Bloodborne, but I I, I gotta stick with Bloodborne. <laughs> Bobby. I'm going to go with Fallout as my game of the year. Um, I, I sank the most time into that game, and I'm not even finished I'm still, with it yet. Like, I'm still um, in the Fallout, too. Yeah. Uh, there's so much to do. It, it's like Skyrim Part 2 for me. Like I had so much fun playing Skyrim uh, on the 360. I still play that to this day, but now that Fallout's out, I can uh, become a hoarder again and just collect <laughs> different things. <laughs> Um, that's the one thing I like put into the strength of my character so he doesn't get stuck as being over encumbered all the time. <laughs> Ooh, what was that word again, Bobby? Over encumbered. Okay. Yeah. And, uh, and like we said, we t- this year, all three of these games. Mm-hmm. Oh, I had I had another game in mind that I I was contemplating on giving mm-hmm. it to. Like, um, like, like I, I, know I just I got it and I'm having a blast with it as um, Battlefront. I mean, there's not much single player to do in it, but I, I enjoy that's the why, multiplayer. That's why, it didn't, that, that's why it didn't win for me, though. Yeah, like, there wasn't like much single player to do. Battlefront had single player, and actually looked like if if if, if the first person shooter aspect was just as good, if not better, squadron. than the Rogue Squadron <laughs> yeah. aspect of this. It would be up there. That is the most fun part of the game, and 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 the the combat's not bad in it as far as, like, the first-person mm-hmm. shooter. But it does feel like a... It feels like a PS2-era game. Hey, which Chachi. that Not saying that's a bad thing. Hey, Chachi. It's a good yeah. thing to have a are we like that, Are but... we uh, swaying or getting Battlefront yet? No, I haven't made a decision. <laughs> uh, I mean, you guys aren't helping. Yeah, I, I know. I, I think know. It's, it's fun, Chachi. It's a, it's I think you should, game. because I think we should. that should be a game we should, we should play together, because we no, both have an Xbox One. I, I will get, at this rate, I'll get uh, 2K16 before I, I get yeah. I have that, too. I think but, it's on uh, sale this week. Yeah, I'll, I'll get that before I get Battlefront at this, at this rate. I think it's on sale on Amazon for, like, um, 40 bucks. But like I was going to say, Syndicate it was, is a great game. Uh Fallout is a great game. Mm-hmm. Bloodborne is a great game. It was a great year for gaming. <laughs> uh, but also oh, we man. had, like, like we were saying before, Splatoon, uh, Mario Maker, whenever we played it. The we're, in, we're basically in the second year of a console of console cycles, and that's when consoles start to get, the good games start to come out. Like, mm-hmm. when, when, the, the launch titles... Are just like okay, well, this is a fun game, and now now we're getting to the, like the meat and potatoes of the games that are coming out. Like the good ones are starting to, to show up. Right, we get the real yeah. games now. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. here, here, I don't, I don't want to step on you, and I know we're probably running out of time here, but I want to get your your guys' opinions on one thing. Okay. Next year, what game are you picking up? Oh. Well, I mean, it's easy. Like, I right could, now, what, what games I can you... easily tell you, without a doubt, uh-huh. Assassin's Creed, Call of Duty. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. If, yeah. If they don't delay it, Zelda. Exactly. 
I'm actually excited for Gears of War, the new Gears of War game. I think that one I might pick up. For me, uh, like Chachi, uh, uh, if Call of Duty comes out, the new Assassin's Creed comes out, especially if Zelda comes out. Right, I mean... But... No Man's Sky. Yeah, you get that one. That's going to be huge. You get Street Fighter V. Eh. <laughs> it's a fighting game. Right. I know. It's not a real game. It's a real I game. I mean, I don't know. I, to be fair, I don't remember much else that's coming out next year at this point. Mm-hmm. Um, so as soon as I start hearing advertisements oh, or commercials oh. about it, I'll pick it up. I got one. Yeah. I got I got one I'm thinking of. Just thought of it. Overwatch. That's yeah. my big one. I mean, it, I don't know. Maybe. Oh, and and of course, I I got I gotta stick with my guns here. Uh, Andromeda, Mass Effect Andromeda. Oh yeah, yeah. And Is that gonna be ready next? They said holidays of 2016. Oh wow. Whole year left. Hmm. And um, oh, what was the other one that was coming out? Oh, Dark Souls three. That bloody yeah. statue that they had at the E3. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, right now I'm more concentrating on remembering that Deadpool comes out in February yeah. than I am of any game coming out in 2016. <laughs> hey, that Deadpool game's on sale. On I know. <laughs> I saw. I almost, almost did it. Uh, let almost. me, let me, be, let me be the judge. Let me, let me be the swaying vote here. Don't get it. I mean, it's okay. It's okay. It, it's a it's, it's okay. It's a, it's a Deadpool game, but yeah. it's not. It is. It is a, definitely a Deadpool game. It's just it's not the best game. Right. But it's a good Deadpool game. It is a very good Deadpool. Game. It is a good Deadpool game, uh, but it's not one of those things where you know I can sit there and say I'm going to play a Deadpool game and be sad it's not Ryan Reynolds. <laughs> <laughs> and not the Deadpool movie. Um, Bobby, take us away, sir. All right, yeah, uh, we're, we're going to keep talking yeah, about movies. I know. Uh, I just wanted to take a moment to thank all of our listeners and our sponsors, uh, Splice Slice on Broadway, for supplying pizza to the podcast for us. Um, and just thank you for listening to us. If you've listened to us uh, over the over the two years we've been doing this, I think two three years now, um, and. You can follow us on at InsertCoinTV uh, and go to the website, InsertCoinToBegin.com. New articles going up daily. And you can uh, just follow us individually. Uh, Chachi, you have any plugs? Uh, just follow me on the Twitters, at Chachi Says, for your daily asinine tweets of 140 <laughs> characters or less. All right, Riz, what, what do you have any plugs? Actually, I do. I do. Uh, right now... It's been about two hours now since it, it's been up. Uh, go to Riz Plays Games on YouTube. Uh, I have... I have... I tried to do a... I, I watched the latest uh, Curtis Axel. You, you watched the Curtis yes, Axel one, but you I did. did not watch the latest one. I didn't watch the latest one, but I watched this Curtis Axel one. With uh, legend General Adnan al <laughs> Uh what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to go from 1 to 30 with a random character in WWE, WWE lore. Um, Curtis Axel was sadly eliminated. Spoilers. In, uh, <laughs> I'm telling you when. You Who was he eliminated by, Chris? I'm not going to tell you. You have to check it out. Um, but uh, starting next month, January 4th, or the first... First Monday of January. January fourth. Yes. Mm-hmm. I will have one video a week of the wrestle uh, of the Royal Rumble challenge. Not gonna say who. Not gonna say what we did. How we how good we did. That's right. Plural we. Um, but you guys just have to check it out once a week until the actual Royal Rumble, which is on Sunday the twenty fourth. I don't know, but that that week, that Sunday, will be up. Um, cool. And also, you know, Riz plays games on Twitter. Subscribe to me on YouTube. Uh, Bobby, you have not done that yet. Chachi, oh, you have okay. not done that yet. I'll have to do that. Yeah, I, I don't like you. 
<laughs> I don't like you either. But no, no. I, I just I just forgot. I'll, I'll yeah, do that too. right away, Sork. Or Riz. I, I follow you on Twitch. Sork. I, I, I follow you on Twitch. Yes, that counts, follow right? you on Twitch. Yeah. I'll follow, I will subscribe to your YouTubes as soon and as Twitch? we're done here. And Twitch? And no, Twitch? I don't. I don't use Twitch. Hopefully this year I'll be joining you in some Let's Plays. Yeah, I just and, haven't and, had the time we'll, lately. But now that I'm off, maybe I will. You know what? Now we're gonna have some, you know, fun times. We're probably gonna link it up too. Like we're we're gonna have probably maybe maybe we're gonna have an insert coin to begin Twitch page. Who knows? Yeah. Who knows? The Who sky's knows? the limit. Bobby. <laughs> All right, that's gonna do it for us. No, no, but. Know, well, Where can they oh, find oh, you? Oh, you can find me. I'm sorry, I forgot the outro myself. Um, you can find me at Bobby F J Town. Uh, my Twitch page is Grandmaster Sixty, <laughs> which was my <laughs> high school name. Which, uh, yeah. Don't worry, Actually, my college screen name. My my uh, college screen. My my high school screen name was uh, Rizzo Two Forty Six. That's not there. So, all right, that's gonna do it for us. Under game over, everybody. This show is a member of the Sorgatron Media Podcast Network. Find out more at sorgatronmedia.com.